M0FXP Hamtech, take a look here. This is a Uniden SDS 200 receiving DMR. And you can see it's working great. Now, many people have said that since the waterfall upgrade, that the DMR isn't working correctly, but that is not my experience. Now, I've set a shortcut for the waterfall, so we'll go F1. We'll go straight to the waterfall. There's nothing wrong with it. This is one of the, the mysteries of this, uh, <laughs> of this DMR business, uh, and why things do what they do. But uh, yeah, the, uh, the TYT radio I'm using, got here is, uh, it's, it's only a 70 cents radio, so it, it looks identical to the rest of this. Go back to scan, Let's start scanning. There's GB3WR. There's airband. Keep scanning. Back to DMR. I've tried all sorts of things to use. And now Talk group 80. As a, um, as a hotspot. And then DMR number of the person that, talking. Which is a bit easier, I think. I'm in the so UK, southwest to UK. Uh, I'll tangle back to you. And that is a repeater. That is not my hotspot. That's GB3FI, that was. GB7FI. Push the F, then 1. Oh, we have to probably have to hold it first. Hold. F1. GB3WR. With the waterfall. And one or two rumbles of thunder, which was, I wasn't expected uh, during the squally showers and the monsoon. <laughs> Throughout all seasons and all, yeah, all seasons. Working great. Bye for now.